603 now. Tensions were high last night as the Bakersfield City School District Board introduced a new report that would change boundaries for downtown elementary school. 17's Vanessa Dillon has more on what parents need to know and the response to the proposal last night. Vanessa? Well, as we've been reporting, the Bakersfield City School District wants to change the boundaries for downtown elementary. And right now, it's a commuter school for children of people who work downtown and done on a lottery system. But the district is looking to change that to allow families who live nearby to access the school. Now, parents were given the chance to tell the board about their concerns last night, many of them expressing some of those issues. The district has proposed cutting 7th and 8th grades from the school, along with changing boundaries, requiring students who attend the school to live downtown. Neither of my parents graduated from high school, but I went on to get a master's and a doctorate. I believe because I was inspired by the programs that I had access to, the magnet program, the buses, the summer school, the dual immersion, those are special programs. Downtown is a special program, and we have to protect those. The board says boundary changes would be fair for all students. Current students would be grandfathered in, but as they graduate, they, the school would be changed to a traditional boundary school for those who live nearby. Through all of our analysis and conversations, we wanted to keep that integrity to ensure that working families uh, who work in downtown have access to downtown, but we also wanted to make sure that families who live in the immediate proximity as defined by the recommendations of the corridor for the de designated downtown business area also have priority. And so uh, we, we believe it's balanced. We believe that it's fair. We believe that it's, it's appropriate for the campus. And uh, we are excited about bringing back the formal documentation on December 17th for the Board of Thick Action on. And again, because space is limited, enrollment is based on a lottery system. No decisions were made last night. And the school board is set to meet again December 17th. For now, reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Vanessa Dillon, 17 News.